We announced this morning a 1.029 billion capital raise through a rights offer, which represents the important final building block to secure our funding plan. And effectively, it's, as Steve mentioned before, secures our path to half a million ounces of PGE production. The rights offer will be done through an issue of one right for every four and a half shares that are held, with a right to buy an additional share at 22 Rand per share. This represents an approximate 33% discount to yesterday's closing price and a 29% discount to the theoretical x right price or TIRP, also as calculated on yesterday's price. The net proceeds from the rights issue will fund the Maseva acquisition, which we bridge through cash and facilities, and will secure the, ra the ramp up of stale drift in this buoyant market environment. And this secures this, this ramp up through, any, through almost any downside scenario. We have received irrevocable undertakings from major shareholders, including Royal Buffer King Holdings, and in aggregate this, this accounts for about 75% of our shareholder base that have now committed to follow their rights. Royal Buffer King Holdings will be reducing their stake to 40.2% to fund their share in the rights offer. The key dates to the rights offer are highlighted below with full details published in our rights issue circular earlier next week. Our financial results reflect what has been a transformational year for our business through the ramp up of Stale Drift, the acquisition of the Maseve concentrator and the acquisition of Amplat's 33% share of our BRPM JV. The resilience and flexibility of our business, especially in the BRPM mine, was shown in the 7.7% increase in cash generated by our business to 665.9 million rand. This enabled us to fund 37% of our capital expenditure in the peak capex year of Staldrift from our own cash generation. Through our enlarged debt facilities with 1.14 billion funding availability, our cash on hand of 883.5 million, and the 1 billion rand rights offered announced today, we have a robust funding position to create shareholder value through the delivery of our strategic objectives. One of the key focus areas for the finance team for this year and beyond will be the optimization of our corporate and head office functions, especially in the context of the dissolution of the BRPM joint venture with Anglo. There seems to be a narrative these days also of value versus volume, as if these are opposing forces. The two are, of course, not mutually ex exclusive, and our other focus areas will be continuing to create value through the, the ramp up of Staldrift, as well in the pursuit of the UG2 and Crown opportunities that Neil highlighted earlier. 